chili. Beef, turkey, chicken, white, red, beans, no beans, spicy, mild, who cares? As long as it tastes good, your family will eat it, and it's good for you. So if you want to get cooking, meet me in the kitchen. Hey guys, I'm Melissa and I am a wife and a mom of three and I know how hard it is to maintain an active and healthy lifestyle which is why I provide you with short and effective workout videos as well as healthy family friendly cooking videos. If you enjoy this video, I would love it if you would go ahead and subscribe and hit that bell notification as I post workouts on Mondays and Fridays and cooking videos on Wednesdays. And I am so excited because today we are making a white chicken chili that is super easy and it is because you can either use a rotisserie chicken from the grocery store or like I did, go ahead and buy a whole chicken, put it in your crock pot, let it cook, and then shred it up. I put it in my crock pot last night, let it cook overnight, even better, shred it up this morning, and I will get two dinners out of it. So if you guys are ready, go ahead and click that thumbs up button and we will get right into our recipe now. We are going to start by rinsing our beans and then going ahead and mashing up half of them. Mashing up the beans and then adding them to the chili is going to help thicken that chili up. And very simply, I'm just going to go ahead and chop up all of our veggies. And here we go, this recipe is super simple. We are just gonna go ahead and heat up our olive oil, add our vegetables in, and let them saute for about five minutes, just until they start getting a little bit soft. Our vegetables are starting to get soft, so we're ready to add our spices. We're adding our salt, our pepper, our cumin, and our chili powder. And then from there, just let this go ahead and cook for another five minutes, giving it a couple good stirs along the way. As you can see, our vegetables are really starting to get soft. The color is kind of changing from the spices, so then we're ready to add in our four cups of chicken broth. Followed by the juice of our two limes and then our beans and the mashed beans. And then we are going to go ahead and let this simmer on the stove top for about 20 minutes. And then from there, all we're doing is adding in our rotisserie chicken, our corn, and our cilantro, and letting it simmer on the stove top just until it's warm, so about five minutes or so. And as you see here, I am just plating our chili, and then feel free to add whatever toppings you like to add to chili. I'm adding a blend of Monterey Jack and sharp cheddar cheese, some multi-grain tortilla chips, some pickled jalapenos, and then that squeeze of the lime to finish it off. As you can see guys, this chili is super easy and super tasty. Why don't you try mom's chili? I can't. If you guys are looking for more easy dinner recipes, I am going to go ahead and link my sheet pan chicken dinner in the description box down below. I hope you get into your kitchen and make some of this comforting warm chili. And I will see you guys on Friday for a workout. Bye.